lot of young people aren't granted spaces that allows them the ability to debate and speak. So they create spaces in social media, in the classroom, in the cafeteria. But what if we can give them thought-provoking topics, challenge them on their thoughts, ask them their opinions, and allow them to actually think on their feet and respond, giving them the skill sets to be great debaters, giving them the communication skills that they need once they leave school, and also building their self-confidence and leaving them empowered. interesting to see, I'll speak from my daughter's perspective, to see a little anxious coming in and then once she learned and was around her peers to learn what this is all about, she just kind of eased into it. So just a level of exposure to what debate is all about and learning how to um, take on a position that may not necessarily be their own belief, but to take that on, understand the, the points that need to be made to uh, express one's opinion and then counter um, opinions or beliefs that were coming from the other side. That's a, it's a skill and being exposed to that skill at such an early stage, at such an early age, I think is, is phenomenal. Instead of suspending them, I think they should like go to a counselor to help them figure out their problems or why they're doing it. And what is a few days or a week from school if you just gonna go do it again?